Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. If using real-time posting, when you click the Save button on a transaction, it is instantly posted to the appropriate journals and to the general ledger. Most companies use this method. However, if using batch posting, you must post all your transactions before you print certain reports, change accounting periods, or close the fiscal year. Before you post your transactions, you must save all your transactions. Also, if using Sage50 in a network environment, you must have all users except yourself exit the Sage50 company file before you can post the transactions. To post the transactions, select Tasks, System, Post from the menu bar to open the post window. Check the journals from which to post transactions by clicking them to put a check mark in the checkbox next to the name of the journal. Then click the OK button to post the transactions from the selected journals to the general ledger. To edit a batch of journal entries already posted to the general ledger, you must first unpost them. Doing this removes all transactions from the general ledger from the current accounting period and forward. To unpost transactions, select Tasks, System, Unpost from the menu bar to open the Unpost window. Then check the journals from which to unpost the transactions by clicking them to place a check mark in the checkbox for the journal. Then click the OK button to unpost the information back to the selected journals from the general ledger. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.